Hey everybody, thank you for joining What's New. I'm Andrew Forbes on the Zendesk product marketing team and we have a ton of exciting launches to talk with you about today. And joining me today to talk about our launches is Shauna Wolverton. Hey Andrew, I'm Shauna Wolverton. I'm the EVP of product here at Zendesk. Shauna, thank you so much for joining us today. I couldn't think of anybody better to talk about all of the exciting launches that we have today. Do you wanna talk a little bit about what your team does here at Zendesk? <laughs> What is it you say you do here? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, my team uh, is responsible for setting the vision and, and delivering all of the products that you're using uh, every day. So super excited to be here today and to, to talk to you about some of the things we've been working on uh, over the last few months. Well, perfect. We are super excited to have you. Before we get into the launches, I just want to set some context for folks on the call today and talk a little bit about why we're building what we're building and talk about some of the trends that we're seeing in the market. As customer experience leaders, we recognize that now more than ever, customer expectations are rapidly evolving. Customers expect to get service fast and they expect to get it on their own terms. And today, their own terms means that they expect to get service on the same channels that they communicate with their friends and family. And just since April, we've seen a 48% increase in customers moving towards using messaging channels. We also expect this number to rise with over 2.7 billion people expected to use messaging applications by the end of the year. And at Zendesk, we are thinking about how we can help your business deliver an experience that your customers and the rest of your business expects. And we're thinking about three core pillars, the three core ingredients to providing a great customer experience. You need tools that make it easy for your customers. You also need to be able to set your team up for success with the right context. And most importantly, you need tools that work the way that your team wants to work. And so that really grounds everything that we are delivering here in the fourth quarter of the year. As we progress through all of the updates, you're going to see how we are thinking about your end users, how we're thinking about your agents, and how we're thinking about your administrators and delivering the capabilities to all of them, not just delivering on one of these pieces. All righty, Shauna, let's talk a little bit about what's new here in Q4. Can you go ahead and tell us what everybody should be excited about? Absolutely. I mean, and not surprisingly, given how we led everyone to this part of the webinar, but we're really focused in Q4 on providing a great experience around messaging. And we are launching um, the idea of native messaging that is in both our agent experience and that is super easy for you to deploy into all of your end user experiences as well. So Shauna, this sounds incredibly exciting. I mean, messaging is a fantastic way to deliver rich, modern, and automated customer experiences to customers uh, out there in the market. And this is really, like we said, the way that folks want to engage. I have some more stats here. I think we are seeing within our own research that 50% of customers want to use the same channels that they engage with, with friends and family. We talked a little bit about how folks want that before, but there is data to back that up. And we're also seeing that messaging channels have a 98% satisfaction score. So it's what folks want, and it's also a great way to deliver the experience that your customers are expecting. I mean, one of my favorite parts about the messaging experience is how it's embedded in all of the sort of applications and interfaces that we're using, especially right now. I don't know about you, Andrew, but I am doing a lot of ordering of groceries and food and things to my house. And it is fantastic to me that some, you know, right from where I'm doing those things, ordering food, I can connect directly um, with the provider and get support, right? In real time, my milkshake didn't get delivered and, and I, can, I can resolve that, you know, um, in record time. And it's, like I said, it's this idea of, of getting service uh, right where you need it and right when you need it is really what we're trying to uh, enable for all of our customers. It's, it's incredibly exciting. I know that we've we've built messaging in a really interesting way and we've thought about some interesting concepts. You know, 
when we built messaging, we're thinking about how our customers can build stronger customer relationships or how they can give their agents more context with messaging or how they can automate more aspects of their support. And then most importantly, you know, there are businesses out there that have very complex needs, very complex messaging requirements. How can we extend messaging experiences uh, to those types of businesses? I would love to talk a little bit about how we are helping businesses do this. And I'd love to start with how messaging can help a company build stronger customer relationships and hear a little bit about the end user side of messaging. 